Hello everyone, welcome back to a brand new video. It's me again, obviously, Mr. Lonely. Today, we're doing something a bit different. We are actually going to be making a villager breeder. This won't be a massive video because obviously the villager breeder is going to lead into a big video though because we're going to make a big, we're going to make like a big, what's it called? Like a big trading hall. But to do that, obviously we need to breed the villagers. So first off, we're going to go to an abandoned mine shaft that I found, right? And once we've got to the abandoned mine shaft, we're going to get some rails. So I'll see you when I get there. So guys, I've made it successfully down to the abandoned mine shaft. I'm just going to uh, mine as many rails as I can down here. Because obviously you can make uh, rails out of iron, but it's kind of a lot of iron. I mean, when you have a fortune free like pickaxe like I do, I guess it's not really it's not really that hard. But I just I feel it'll be easier. Oh look, I got an apple. Nice. I just think it'll be easier to definitely like get a lot of rails from down here. Because I mean then i'd have to craft them so yeah i'm just gonna see how many i can get down here and yeah i guess i'll be back to the surface with you guys when i've got the rails and there we go as you see i got i got three stacks of rails i mean the village isn't really far away so you never know this actually might be enough rails if that is that'd be really cool but yeah anyway the plan is to obviously we're going to transport villagers because you know the village right next to us right there i uh they're all kind of librarians and I need a farmer and they're all trade locked and there's only like two of them in the village anyway so it's actually better if we just go this way because if you didn't know you actually probably wouldn't because I don't think I've been here in the let's play videos but there is another village over here but we'll just we'll just make a road like a path above this because obviously we just want a straight line I don't want to be wasting too many rails having to like detour but yeah, once I've finished placing these, I'll get back to you. And there we go. That is the very end. We're gonna run out of rails here. So turns out we didn't have enough, which is kind of sad. But you know what? We can craft the rest. So guys, I'm back. If you couldn't tell by my level, I kind of went up like seven levels probably since I last, like, you saw me. But I just went on a bit of a mining sesh. I managed to find a few more rails. I went back down to the abandoned mine shaft, but I could only find about 50 more. So uh, we're going to probably have to get more. But yeah, I didn't put it in the video because, I mean, <laughs> it's just mining. But yeah, we'll just... We'll see how far this takes us. Hopefully it takes us near to at least the edge of the mountain. Because then we can... We'll craft them. We'll craft the rest. I'm not doing another trip down there. But the good thing is, while I was down there, as you see, I got a lot of levels. And I got a lot of, like, resources. So, you know, that's that's good. But anyway, yeah, look. We've run out of rails again. A bit deja vu. So, yeah, I'll get back to you when I, uh, I got more. So I got the rails, I crafted some out of, you know, just standard iron, obviously I'm not getting any powered rails, but as you see I'm actually level 32 now, I did a bit of stuff, like, while I was not here, <laughs> I guess, but anyway, let's just get into this, we're gonna, uh, gonna build across, I'm not placing rails all the way down there, we're just making a nice, nice path all the way up, and you know, we're not even gonna destroy it later, even though it looks ugly still, I... It's not our problem, we're not going to live here guys. We have our cool little area. So you know, we'll just leave this, it'll be fine. I'm sure the residents will love it. But anyway, let's get this to the village. I really don't know where these villages are, I'll be honest. I've kind of been looking around and it, it, this doesn't look good. There is no sign of any villages. They are, there's no way I built all of this all the way over here just for there to be no villages, right?
No, oh my, wait. Oh my god, there's no way they're all down here. Guys, what the hell is this? Why is there, why are there so many just trapped down here? Even the iron golem's trapped down here. Oh, all right, uh, this trait, this is a bit weird. Uh, we're gonna have to mine them out of here. How are we even gonna get them out though? Will they like follow me up here or? Like, what do I do? I didn't, I didn't, I didn't calculate for this to happen. I thought they would all just be like chilling in their houses. What the hell? We, oh, I'm gonna block them off as well so they don't go even further down. All right, could you like come up now, please? Oh, oh, he's actually going up. Nice. That's easier than expected. We'll just block the rest in so uh, they don't leave. Come on. No, not that way. Come on, that way. Come on. So guys, I've got this insanely genius idea where we like put these into the church. So therefore, the villager just goes and gets straight in the minecart and then we could push them all the way back. I know, I know. My genius is kind of crazy. So here we go. Hopefully this goes smoothly. I do not do this very often. Come on bro, get in it. It's so like right there. Come on. Can you get in? Like, hello? Why are you standing next to it? Get in the cart. Get in the cart. What the hell? What's. Oh my god. And there we go. Come on. Come on. There we go. Wait, what? Oh. Oh no. It's not. No, oh no. Quick, we can fix this, right? We just, there we, but you stuck in it. All right, uh, come on, get out, get out a sec. Don't go anywhere, just get out. There we go, get in the car. No, 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 this way, this way. Oh no, please, please, please. You know what guys, I'm going to speed the clip up for this probably and uh, I'll see you again when I get this guy in the minecart because he's not having it. Control my game, I'm trying to play around with those expectations. It's kind of the most fun part. We need to have exploding arrows. They're actually kind of fun. Let's give it a bigger explosion. Let's go, I did it. Oh my God, guys, I bet you were probably facepalming if you saw that. Oh, that took so long. It's not even funny how long that took. That was probably the most embarrassing thing I've ever done in Minecraft history. But you know, I'm keeping it in the video now. Why not show you the pain, the suffering that it took for me to get one villager. And guess what? The worst part is I still have to get another one. But at least we got this guy, at least we got this guy. And there we go, one 
villager down. Yeah, thank God he didn't run off. Imagine he ran off then. So we'll just uh, protect this guy because I do not plan on losing this guy after everything I just went through. So we're just going to do a little box. Obviously, it's not going to be uh, anything special and we don't even have enough wood. We'll just use wood. Why not? There we go. One down. One more to go. Well, guys, I actually have a plan now. I'm going to mine some dirt real quick and then I'm going to make a little pathway so the villagers will not escape and we can do this one so much more quicker than the last one because obviously nothing can go wrong now we've done it once not even jinxing myself it's just true there's no way we can mess this up again so let's just fill out this and then we'll have a nice route for our villager to walk down see that look the only place this guy can go is the church so if this guy doesn't want to go in the church then i'm gonna have a word of him all right here we go come on get up get up we have successfully managed to get the villa his hole let's go never mind don't you dare jump no nope. don't nope. there we go no not that way look this is a closed off area you can't even go that way where are you looking <laughs> over here come on come on i need you I need to make, come on, my, my, oh my god, just go, th there we go, you need, you're important, you're important for the villager trading hole that we're gonna make, alright, come on, go up the stairs, that, no, why would you, alright, I'm speeding this up as well, that this is gonna be painful, I can tell. Guys, I did it. I'm so glad. This really shouldn't be this hard though, let's be honest. <laughs> I don't I don't even know why I found this so hard, but I did, let's be honest. That took so long. This video would be triple the length if I didn't cut out me trying to get two villagers in minecarts. But you know, the important thing is it's done. I never have to do this again, alright? That is the important thing. Just remember that. And there we go, guys. Scott's here now, by the way. I don't even know why, but he is here. He, I think he, he, he came to pay me a visit. Come on, look. There we go. And they're in. That's all the matters. Thank God for that. We can get rid of a few of these now. There we go. Wait, I just realized. Why would the... What the hell? Wait, what did Scott do? Is he griefing? He's a griefer. What the hell? What the hell is this? There's no cows in it. Oh my god, he must have done this by accident, surely. Oh no. What, what has he done? This is not part of the video. <laughs> what the... Uh, oh my god. Uh, Well, the cows are uh, free range now, I guess. At least he's trying to get them in. Hold on, let me help this guy. Quick, get in. I don't know how many more go in. They were so jam-packed in. You know what? You gotta go. Sorry. Sorry. Get out of here. Get out of here.
Get out. There we go. There we go. Let's just get the remaining. I mean, at least we'll have some. Oh, uh, I don't have a hoe. I'll, I'll sort that out later. Well, we're going to have some beef, I guess. There we go. Uh, let's just pretend that didn't happen. Uh, and let's continue with the video. Woo! So guys, here we're gonna we're just gonna build it here. To be honest, I'm gonna go for a design. These are kind of all the blocks you'll need for this, by the way. If you haven't realised that chest has been there for quite a while, I think it was in the other videos. You might have been able to see it. But anyway, if you want to build a farm like this, I mean, you can kind of copy what I'm doing, I guess, or you just go Google all the videos because there's like loads of videos on this. This is pretty common, breed, like villager breeding farm. I like it as well. It's not too complicated. It's just, yeah, it's just nice and chill. So we're just, oh, our po break. Broke, not break. Let's just quickly make another stone one. There we go. Fill this in. So basically, it uses carrots and it uses, like, the, uh, what are they called? The farming villagers. Luckily, I have a mini carrot farm. It's not a too big carrot farm, but we have, a, like, a little mini carrot farm, which is pretty chill. So let's just fill these in. There we go. Boom. Last bit. I'm never gonna really use carrots. This is like the this is like I swear the only use for them. Who's actually using carrots? Oh it looks like Scott's still here. And he appears to be watching. He's like he's he's watching his prey. I'm the prey. Oh, I don't know how we didn't break that back then. Well, let's just... We're gonna... I'm pretty sure... Yeah, you put the beds down here. Oh, I forgot that we're kind of living on a floating island right now. Because uh, <laughs> we uh, filled in a lot of the land, remember? So we're just gonna quickly put this stone brick here. There we go. Now we're just gonna put like a nice... Not nice, but you know, we're gonna put a cobble wall around it. We'll probably add a design. Try and make it look similar to our other farms. Like... But first, we're just going to try and get it functioning, you know. It's important that the farm actually works, rather than, you know, it looking nice. Remember that, guys. Functionality overlooks. That is, that is a wise moment right there. So we're just going to fill this in. So I added, like, a bit of cobble around the edge, as you can see. I kind of... There, yeah. I don't know. I don't think it looks that great. But, oh well. We're just gonna gonna move the villagers in now, cause uh, like the actual bit's fine. Here we go. Oh look, that Scott's doing parkour on the thing. Hey, shout out to Scott. <laughs> Otherwise, I've had to get out that. There we go. Boom, boom. Get rid of those. Get in there. And here we go. Got one in. Hey, had Scott's got the other one. Nice. All right, boom, now we can uh, put the door back on. Where do we have a trap door? No, we don't, hold on, we're gonna have to quickly craft one. There we go. Boom, this is looking more like a farm, or a breeding farm. Well guys, this is kind of the mini carrot farm. I don't know if I've shown it in one of our episodes, I don't think I have, but yeah, we're just gonna get a few more carrots because you need to give the villagers carrots, I mean, you. A lot of you guys probably know that, but yeah, they need their like inventories full of carrots, so that's what we're gonna get. And here we go. Take my carrots. Take them all. So yeah, we're just gonna give these guys some carrots. There we go. And soon they should be making nice little babies, if you know what I mean. Here we go. It's nearly all of them. Should we give them the other stack? Why not? Just give them all of them. We don't need them anymore anyway. It's not like carrots are a good food source. I guess golden carrots are okay, but who's actually making those? Bread is where it's at. Bread and steak, because I have fire aspect on my sword. I also need to get some uh, sand, because uh, we've kind of run low on glass, and I'm going to make the roof glass, because I'll see the villagers, you know. I'm going to give them some light. I'm kind of a nice guy like that. But yeah, so... They're actually a no-close sand biomes by where I am by the way guys so <laughs> coming here is not very fun but you know it is what it is and uh, I'll be back once we've got the glass guys guys look 
There is a baby villager in there, which means the farm actually works. Let's go. So uh, we can actually just work on improving the design of this now. I'll probably uh, speed some of this up. Well, there we go. I've kind of got like the frame down. So I'm just going to put like some of these, uh, you know, I don't know what they're called, like overhangs, I guess. I put them on a lot of my builds, so this doesn't look, hmm, let me figure this out. All right, there we go, boom. So there's the framing done, and now we need we need some we need some stairs on this, I think, and we need probably some leaves. I'm gonna go for you know the standard layout that we've done because it's not gonna be too crazy. It's just a villager breeder, but you know it's just got a lot better than kind of the default villager breeder does. Well, I've got some uh, stairs now, so we're just going to put them on all the edges, you know how it is. <laughs> You've seen me do this before. <laughs> do this quite a lot. I think on some stuff it looks alright, on some it doesn't. Like on the barn, when I tried to do it at the front, remember it in episode 1 if you even watched that. Didn't look that great, so I got rid of it. But, you know, it'll look good on a build like this probably. But anyway, I'm thinking we should add some logs here as well. It's not, it's not enough, you know what I mean? There we go. Otherwise, it'd have been like there'd have been nothing there, you know. Got to add a tiny bit of detail, I guess. Well, the frame's kind of done now, and now we're gonna use leaves, like you know, over here on the sugar cane farm. Yeah, we're gonna do the same thing over here. So yeah. And there we go, the leaves have been placed down. Now, I uh, guess we got to do the ceiling, I kind of forgot about that. But here we go. Uh, yeah, we use glass for this, I think. And there we go, that is the roof complete. So, I guess all that's left is kind of doing the door. So we can actually access the villagers. All right, let's just quickly mine through this. Let's see that, look at that. Look at how many villagers we got down there now. That is actually sick. Let's just, just mine a bit of this. There we go. Where is the cobble there? Boom, boom. They didn't even try and escape, what, what good little things whatever they're called all right let me craft a door and make this entrance
And there we go, guys. I hope you enjoyed this episode. It was probably not the most interesting because it was just me making a breeding farm, but you never know. You might have found it really interesting, me uh, completely failing at doing it. But honestly, this our base area is looking pretty cool right now. But anyway, hope you enjoyed. Stay tuned for the next one. I'll see you later.